and welcome to your Go Market update today with Mark Smith, Senior Analyst from Go Markets on Friday, the 3rd of June 2022. Fantastic to see you here. Let's just have a look at what's coming across the news today. Of course, US equities had a strong session last night, recovered from a weak start, and that two day pause we've seen. We had significant broad based gains as the jobs numbers did no harm to sentiment and markets are perceiving some value at the levels that we are trading at now. US futures are trading positively in early trading and Asian indices are following that US lead. ASX is up around 1% and European futures are also pointing to a higher open. With that equity strength we saw a weak session for the USD index overnights move back to support levels. And consequently, of course, gold was strong, moved back up to 1875, back over that 1850 level. So a nice pop in gold. We also saw the same in copper with copper popping 5% to obliterate resistance at 435 and is now back over that critical 450 level. Oil is hovering below that 120 at this stage and the VIX is testing that 25 support level, which is pretty important in terms of sentiment. But of course, don't forget that we do have some significant data out later, which may impact on this, of course. Bitcoin is just trading above that key 30,000 level, which it pulled back to yesterday. And of course, the non-farm payrolls are the major data point out today. On top of that, we've got global PMI numbers and German trade balance also noteworthy. Let's just have a look at a couple of charts that have caught our eye this morning. Uh, we're going to start with copper, actually. We can see not only did it break that 435 resistance, but actually smashed through the 200 EMA as well. 454 is where we're trading now. This is a really key level and could see us up as high as another 10 cents on this to take us up to 465. And then we have those highs of five dollars those record highs that we hit in february in our sites undoubtedly this looks strong but you do see it is a little shy in asia today but this tradable commodity is one worth keeping your eye on be interested to see what happens as the lme opens later with stocks we can't help but be impressed by nvidia following this double bottom and then we had a little pullback to that breakout point at 182.50 before yesterday's session which closed at the high around 195 we've got 204 as a point of interest and if we break this we should be on for a test of 220 this has been really strong over the last week and it looks as though buying pressure is well and truly in trade safe and we'll see you again soon bye bye for now